Welcome to the Logic Support Portal, your go-to platform for all your support needs. In this instruction video, we will take you through the new dashboard and guide you on how to raise a support ticket. To access the updated support portal, simply visit the URL supportdesk.logics.in. We understand the importance of convenience, which is why we have retained your existing login information. You can use your existing support desk login credentials to log in. Furthermore, the portal also allows the admin to add users and these users can log in with their respective credentials. For additional layer of security, entering CAPTCHA is also required. Once you log into the system, you could see the new Logic Support Desk Portal interface. The portal is redesigned to make it simple and convenient for you to use. On dashboard, you have a complete set of data from total tickets, pending cases, closed tickets, certified tickets, ticket pending for approval and dissatisfied tickets. Additionally, your dashboard provides access to ticket analysis reports and feedback analysis reports presented through visually appealing charts. Now we shall guide you through the important steps of raising a new ticket which is a crucial activity for our customers when reporting any issues they are facing. First, locate the top menu where you will find several options such as Dashboard, Configuration, Support and Report. From the available options, click on Support to proceed. Once you have clicked on Support, further click on Open Ticket to proceed. On the Open Ticket page, you will be able to view all the open and pending tickets. Each assigned a unique ticket ID number. To create a new ticket, simply click on New Ticket button provided on top of this page. You can log a request from here using two options. Select Self if you are an authorized logged in user. It shall fetch your data available in the system and pre-fill this data in the required fields to save time. In case if you are not authorized admin, use this option. In case if you are raising the ticket on behalf of the admin user in your company who do not have the access to the system at the given time. Here you need to enter admin name, email id, mobile number so that system could record the data for any of your next ticket activity. Location This shall be automatically populated by the portal as per the information provided by customer. Over here, please select the location where you are facing the issue or please select the location for which you want to open the ticket for. Services A drop-down of the services that you have purchased from Logix along with the subscribed support will appear. Type of complaint You can select problem or question if there are certain queries or request if you need any additional information or update. Impact of issue Here you need to specify till what extent the issue is impacting your users. Less than 50% users impacted or more than 50% users impacted or specific user. Product support It will automatically display the support service as per your account subscription. Priority The priority will be set as per the impact of issue. Type of issue Select the issue that you are facing from the drop down option. Sub issue Further questions are added so that the engineer know the specifics of the case correctly. This helps us understand your problem area and avoid back and forth communication. More details This is an optional field provided to add more details to your case. Description In addition to this, you can further explain the problem in the description window. Also in case the issue details are not covered in the type of issue field, then you can add the details here. Attachment You can capture specific inputs like logs, header information or any error and attach as per the allowed extensions. Click on add. The 
new ticket is created with a unique ID with all the details such as ticket date, service, subject, submitted by, assigned to status. You can click on option to see further details. On the dashboard, the pending cases tab will be updated. The same ticket will be reflected in pending tickets table and latest five tickets table. You simply need to click on the ticket ID number to see further information. Let's see how to find the ticket ID. Click on support, click on search ticket, enter ticket number and search the ticket. Click on option to check the status. Now we will move on to tickets which are pending for approval. With further development from logic support team, once the ticket is resolved, it gets updated in the ticket pending for approval. Click on option. You can close the case if the issue is resolved or you have the option to reopen the case. Your feedback is very important for us. Please mention your comment, rate your experience and add suggestions if any for us to analyze the overall activity. This will help us learn, improve and understand where we could add more value to make support task effective. If you have any further questions or need assistance, please don't hesitate to reach out to our dedicated support team. All your issues, queries and requests need to be raised through support desk portal only. Thank you for choosing Logic support portal for all your support needs.